think I've sort of left you guys hanging as far as where, where we're at and what we're doing. But if you can see in the background, we arrived home, home last night about five o'clock. Unfortunately, we had to leave Montana much faster than my heart was ready for. So I am going through the transition that is so difficult for me to do, which is coming home from uh, harvest time which is basically that's all that we are doing is focusing on harvest and whether the sun is shining or not to back to being home with commitments and whatnot and paying attention to the clock i'm struggling i have so much content to share for the last few days of being in montana and on our way home but that's going to have to wait because right now i've got to focus on getting this trailer house unloaded and moved everything back into the house. So as soon as I can get to that point, I will put those videos together and share that with you. But for today, it happens to be an anniversary of the Huff Fire. This happened four years ago today. I'm gonna share that video today with you by putting it up here in the corner. So all you have to do is click on that notification right there and you'll be able to watch that uh, fire. It happened while we were in Jordan four years ago. Jamie and her family was there with us. So it was uh, quite intense. It was quite scary. But in the end, everything turned out okay. No human lives were lost. There were some animals that unfortunately lost their lives and a lot of acres that were burned. Tomorrow, Jim already begins his fall harvest back in the combine with the farmer that he helps here locally. So things are moving quite rapidly. Jim will be picking. Yes, I said picking, not cutting or harvesting. We still refer to corn harvest as picking corn. He will be picking high moisture corn and they will be able to put that in a bin that has a dryer. So he's gonna get a head start. I'm expecting my fall harvest job not to begin for about another month. Everything is still pretty green. There is some drying down on the corn, but not a lot. We will see you again very soon. Hey, Jim and I really hope that you enjoyed today's daily update. If you did, why don't you give it a thumbs up for us? We'd like to know that. And be sure to hit the subscription button and the bell notification so that you know when the next video is up and ready to watch. Thank you, and we're so glad you're along with us for the journey.